Our next question is to an AC power supply of 220 volts at 50 hedges, a resistor of 20 ohms, a capacitor of uh, reactance 25 ohms and an inductor of reactance 45 ohms are connected in series. The corresponding current in the circuit and the phase angle between the current and the voltage res respectively. So it is from AC current uh, chapter. So the thing is there are uh, resistor, capacitor and inductor in the circuit which are connected in series. So a resistor, a capacitor and an inductor which are connected in series with a battery or power source so which is uh, 220 volts and 50 hedges source. So now the resistance of this resistor is given that is 20 ohms and capacitor is given 25 ohm reactance. Reactance of the capacitor is given that is 25 ohms and uh, uh, reactance of inductor is given that is 45 ohms. We need to find out the phase angle and respect to current in the circuit. I will consider phase angle first. So phase angle tan phi is equal to Z by R where Z can be written as XL minus XC by R which is equal to XL that is 45 ohms minus 25 ohms by 20 ohms. So 20 by 20 you will get 1. So at a tan phi you will get 1 that means phi is 45 degrees. Phi is equal to 45 degrees. So phase angle is 45 degrees. It means either 3 or 1. Now come to the current part. To find the current part we need to you need to find the total effective reactance. So total reactance Z is equal to square root of R square press XL minus XC whole square which gives R square is 20 square this is also 20 square you will get 20 root 2 as the impedance of the total circuit then your i is equal to v by r or v by z here so that is equal to v is 220 by z is 20 root 2 so 21s are 20 11s are 11 by root 2 11 by root 2 means 11 by 1.414 nearly it will be 7.8 so it is 7.8 so the answer would be third one so answer would be the third one